Hey guys, Dave here from theapplejunkie.com um, and today I want to do a tutorial um, and it's not just a, any tutorial. Um, if you guys don't know, um, I have switched over from the iPhone to the Nexus 1. Now don't don't panic, I still have an iPod Touch so I'll still be doing tutorials and uh, you know tweaks and showing you guys how to do different things so don't worry about that. Alright, so basically this tutorial is going to be for the Nexus 1 and this is going to show you how to unlock it and to root it which is another word for jailbreaking in the iPhone world. Alright, so let's get to it. First thing you want to do is I'm going to give you all the links that you need. All right, this is the first link you're going to go to here. I'll be the posted on the bottom, or uh, or and I'll put it on the sidebar. All right, so basically what you want to do is you want to de uh, determine what uh, firmware you have, and by doing that, um, you can go to your your settings. All right, let me go here real quick. Go to your little uh, settings, and then you go to about phone. All right, and then what you want to do is you want to go down to your uh, right here build number, which mine is the EDR79. I'm not sure if you can see that. All right, so let's go down here. All right, to the firmware or the build number. All right, you have the EPE76, you know, you have all these different builds. So this is what you want to do is you want to get uh, two files. You want to get the fast boot, which is the um, folder that's going to unlock the actual uh, 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 bootloader. All right, and then what you want to do is you want to get a super boot, which is going to let you go ahead and uh, install different ROMs, you know, root it, give you the root access. All right, so first things first, let's go ahead. We can go ahead and download it. And then basically you're going to download it to, well, it's going to probably go to the uh, downloads file. All right, so what we're going to do is once that's done here, all right, well, where is he right here? All right, you want to go ahead and get that super boot and then drag it over to your desktop. And then you want to rename it super boot for, you know, easy purposes all right the next thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and uh, go to this link here all right and you're gonna want to download the fast boot which is the basically the unlocker okay so we'll do that excuse me we're gonna do that and do the same thing as well get it out of your downloads put on your desktop and it should be it should already say fast boot all right, so now you have these two files. We're going to keep it on the desktop to make everything easy because we're going to send some commands. All right. Now, first thing you want to do is you want to unlock it. All right, so how do we do that? Okay, we're going to close this out. Okay. First thing you want to do is you want to hold down the track button. <clears throat> okay. And then press the power until the light comes up. Okay. That's your fast boot. Now, as you can see on top here, mine says unlocked up there. Yours won't say anything until we, we uh, unlock it. So we're just going to leave it like this. All right, leave it just like this. Now, we want to go and open up terminal. All right, and then we're going to type in CD desktop forward slash fast boot. Okay, hit enter. Now you're in that directory where that folder is at. And if you don't believe me, or you don't believe yourself, just type in ls, hit enter, and it'll give you the uh, files and stuff that are in that particular uh, directory. All right, so now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and you want to type this command, which I'll give you down at the bottom here. All right. And then you can just uh, follow follow it step by step which is uh, um, period forward slash fast boot fast boot mac whoop, mac oem unlock enter all right and as you can see here it'll go through its its mode here um, it says info device was already unlocked okay so 
when everything is done here, um, the last thing that you should see is okay. Now that you now that's all done. Okay, we're still on the fast boot. Now, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and um, type in CD, and that'll bring you right back to the top here. So what you want to do is you want to type in CD space desktop forward slash super boot. That's going to get us into that super boot directory now, which is this folder right here. Okay. And like I guess like I like I said before, if you second guess yourself, just type in ls and it'll pull everything up that's in there. Alright, now for this one, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and we're gonna type in chmod space plus x uh dash install uh, uh dash superboot dash mac dot sh okay and then you want to hit enter okay now it's going to go through its stuff here all right and then once the last thing that you should see is okay all right now that that's done now that's now that that's done um basically you unlocked it and you rooted it so what you should see now when you go ahead and go to reboot okay by by pressing the volume down button and then go into the reboot and then hit the power button that's gonna give you uh, that's gonna basically be like the enter button alright and now you should see the unlock here that's going to show you now that you're um, unlocked and rooted. Alright, so if you guys have any questions, um, you can email me, you can comment, you can DM me, whatever you like. Um, I hope this helped you guys out because I haven't seen too many videos. I actually haven't seen any videos that explain exactly how to do it for a lot of people that don't know how to uh, type command. So, like I said, if you guys have any questions, just uh, PM me or comment or, or hit me with an email. All right, guys. So, Dave here from theapplejuggy.com. I'll see you later. Peace.